Okay, so the story goes, the resale killers on YouTube, look them up. They're real people. They live out in California, but yeah, they're a little crazy, but that's what I like about them. <laughs> Sorry, Stephen Steph. Anyway, back in November, October, November, they put out a video or two about how to buy stuff from government liquidation. So I thought to myself, hey, I got that big old truck over there. I could get two pallets in the back of that pickup. And I got a trailer over there. I could hook up the trailer to the pickup and get maybe five pallets at a time. So anyway, during the winter this winter, I bought 12 pallets of government liquidation. I got backpacks and sleeping bags. You can look at my past videos to see that. But this is a good story here. This is, it weighs about 60 pounds. This is a manhole hatch for a ship. You weld this bottom part to the deck of your ship and then you can unscrew the bolts and take the top off and crawl down in your ship. Screw it back down at the end of your, whatever you're doing down in the hole. And yeah, it's weather tight. So why am I showing you this? Well, I sold one of them. I actually got two of them. A lot of times when you buy stuff from government liquidation, you don't know what you're gonna get. You know, you get a manifest, but, and then so you buy a pallet, you know, let's say there's 20 backpacks in the pallet and two manhole hatches, and you don't even know what a manhole hatch is. So you buy at auction the uh, pallet, and you bring the pallet home, and you look down in the pallet, and sure enough, there were two of these guys, but I sold one of them. But what's cool about it, let me show you on the computer. So yeah, what's so cool about the sale of the hatch is that it went to Gotham Set Decorators, or Decorations, which is the TV show. <laughs> so, watch your, if you're a person who watches Gotham, the TV show, look in future episodes for one of those. Uh, where to go? Uh, yeah, one of those. <laughs> and yeah, they paid for the shipping, and they on top of the shipping, they paid me two hundred eighteen sixty six for the manhole cover. So I thought that was really cool. So another cool sale was this oil lamp that's been converted into an electric lamp. And yeah, this was in a storage unit that I bought. My last couple of videos I've been showing the storage unit. And so, yeah, this was a good sale I made on eBay recently. Haven't shipped it yet. So let me show you what it sold for. So yeah, there it is. I spent $170 to buy the storage unit, which I'm still not finished emptying. I'm going to have some more videos of emptying more stuff out there. This cranberry cherub glass marble lamp sold for $351. What? That's a cool sale, I think. Yeah, gotta love antiques. So yeah, and I've had some other cool sales, but I'm not going to go into them right now because right now, I want to show you one of the things that I bought with some of my profits from eBay. All right. So yeah, if you're a retired old school teacher and most of your income comes from um, your retirement check, thank you, Texas Teacher Retirement System of Texas. <laughs> uh, and if you sell a few things on eBay, you can afford to buy a little gold to pad your your nest with future needs maybe pass a little on to future generations so this is a 20 franc 
gold coin made in 1909 unless it was a restrike which doesn't really matter it's just buying gold for gold content and this is a cool size coin to own it's bigger than a one tenth ounce and it's smaller than a one quarter ounce so you can always buy gold at whatever amount that you have to invest it doesn't have to be gold you could buy silver or whatever you're, you're wanting to buy it's a really neat coin Equalidad uh, Fraternitide something Libertad so this is called the uh, the rooster the 20 franc coin comes in several different kinds there's one with an angel there's one with a um, rooster this one's called the rooster there's one uh, with several of the uh, royals of the time on the obverse. The obverse is the front and the reverse. And so, yeah, it's a, it's a good, good investment coin. These don't cost much over the gold standard gold price. And I got this coin for... 10% off because um, eBay was running a 10% um, eBay bucks so they pay so if you buy a coin for like whatever this was 200 bucks whatever it was uh, let's say it was 200 bucks so if you get 10% then you get 20% of eBay or 10% of eBay bucks which is $20 to apply to your next purchase so uh, yeah that's a beautiful coin that's a pretty girl she's got a little cap on and this is from France and the rooster it's a beautiful coin love them it's a good size um, so if you're not into buying a full ounce of gold you don't have to buy an ounce you can buy a tenth of an ounce you can buy this coin which is between a tenth and a, and two tenths or you can buy two tenth ounces or you can buy a quarter ounce whatever you got to invest at, at the time is a good way to invest so this is your silver hair stacker saying good luck god bless 20 franc coins don't ignore them they're really neat coins beautiful designs and you can get several different designs of them so bye